Uh, yes, hello, Jacqueline. This is Ray, and I wanted to make this uh, short video to kind of go over the um, current website I have in rough draft form for you. Um, again, keep in mind, like I said, this website, uh, this is just a first draft. Um, it's a little bit rough around the edges. It's basically the framework that I have uh, completed and the overall layout. And I just wanted to make this video to kind of introduce to you what I have going so far. Um, go over the separate features of the website, give you a chance to look over my work so far, and uh, give me your feedback before I uh, continue to finalize everything. Now, this is the home page of your website. As you can see, it's very, uh, very professional looking. Uh, the colors are perfect for the type of service that you're offering. And here, what I have is I wanted to add a modern touch. I wanted to add something um, with a little bit of pizzazz to the website. So I have this slider here. And when you click on each one of these tabs, um, what I want is when you click on each tab, I want uh, the information to be displayed up here. So for example, when you click on simple application, you get a little bit of information about the uh, ease of applying for the business loans. Um, when you click on fast decisions, you get some information about how quickly you can get approved. When you click on business loan specialist, you learn, learn a little bit more about the company and your expertise. Um, and then when you click on apply now, it tells you about how easy it is to apply. So basically what I have is this top slider here. Um, and I think this, it adds a real nice modern touch. I'm going to edit the way the information is displayed here, but it gives you an idea of um, basically the home page and the impression that I want to uh, that I want to make, which is a very professional impression. But I also want the site to have a modern look to it. I don't want it to look old. Um, so this gives it a real nice modern professional touch. Up here you have your navigation bar, and like you asked for, we have select your business. And when you drop down, you can see all of the different types of services. Uh, excuse me, um, businesses that you want to offer this service to. For example, convenience and quick stops, dentists, retail storefront, restaurants and cafes. It's very easy for you to add to this, but I set you up with four example um, industries to target. Now, let's say, for example, if you click on convenience and quick stop, you'll be taken to a page specifically for convenience and quick stops. And you can see that um, this is just dummy content that I put in here. It's up to you to um, edit the content and to put the content in, which is very easy to do using the visual editor that I'll set up for you. But you can see that each one of these, for example, dentists, each one of these can have specific content um, directed to this business. So here you see a picture of a dental office. Um, and if we go here to restaurant and cafes, for example, you'll see a picture of a restaurant. So you can actually log into the back end area of this website and set up each one of these pages for these specific industries. Let's go ahead and go back to the home page. So I can finish going over that with you. And then here at the bottom of the home page, what I wanted to do is um, put two of what I feel are the best um, reasons to go with your company. And that is the personal service and support that you offer. And also the fact that you offer cash to boost business. Um, you know, people can use their cash to expand their business, advertise their business. So I wanted the home page to basically I wanted the home page to basically touch on these two benefits, which is you can use the cash to boost your business and that unlike a lot of other online services, you really offer personal service and support. And then at the bottom here, I figured this is a good area to put your social uh, network icons, your, for example, your Facebook, Twitter, and email link, which I'll finish setting up for you. Um, if you think that it's a good idea to put it here, um, one of the last final steps is that I will set up your uh, Facebook, Twitter um, links for you. And then here we have a link to uh, your frequently asked questions page. And also on the bottom we have return to top. So if somebody is scrolling the home page of the website, they scroll down, they can click here to return to the top, they can add themselves to your Facebook and Twitter network or send you an email. And they also have here a link to your frequently asked questions 
page and when you click on that you'll be taken to a page where I think it would be a good idea to put frequently asked questions and answers about your service. You'll notice that every page to the right area has a sidebar which um, instead of just having boring links um, I wanted to add a graphical sidebar menu link here and I can edit this uh, to whatever you want these links to say but it's I figured it's a good idea to have links to the um, page about your personal service and uh, your promise to offer good support and then we have a link to the easy application page and um, as you can see here the application form will go on this page and then we have a link to your page where you can explain how you have the highest approval ratings in the industry and then we have a link to your questions and answers page so you can see that the website um, is made up of the home page so you have the home page here and then you have all of the sub pages that you can go to and the purpose of the home page is to lead people into the sub pages of your website now they can do that by either clicking more here okay and that'll be taken to a sub page of your website or they can click on any of these navigation links or they can go up here to any of these areas if they have um, if they fall into one of these categories um, they can go into one of these specific areas and learn more about their uh, their options if they're a, a retail storefront or a dental office or a quick stop and then we have a standard contact page if somebody wants to send you an email if they have a question about your service so basically you can see the overall framework and layout that I've done um, pretty much the website is almost complete I would say it's about 85 percent done uh, what I wanted to do at this stage is at least show you the framework, show you the layout that I've come up with, the color scheme, let you go over um, the website so far, tell me your uh, feedback, any thoughts that you have, so that if there's anything you do want changed, I can change it before finalizing everything. Now, some of the things that I'm going to do when finalizing the website is I'm going to create a, um, a different logo to put up here this is just temporary I wanted to have something to put up here in the meantime um, I'm also going to edit this content area for the slider to look a little bit more polished um, but you can see that my idea is that we have four main topics here and when you click on each topic you'll have a little bit of teaser information something to just kind of whet the appetite in this area and then there will be this more button that will prompt people to click here and learn more so this is a good little teaser area to kind of give people a summary of what you do they can click around and whatever strikes their interest they can click more and then of course you have these two main areas here and I can change this to cover any other topic you choose but I think having personal service and support to the right and cash to boost your business I think those are the two topics that people are going to be drawn into the most uh, you know frankly people are looking for cash to boost their business and they want to make sure that if they do apply they're going to be treated with um, respect good customer service and support so having these two here I think are the best options um, so please, uh, Jacqueline, go ahead and look over the site. Tell me what you think so far. Tell me what you think about the color scheme and layout. And if everything, um, if the direction that I'm going in is to your liking, I can go ahead and wrap up the website, polish it up for you, and uh, get everything done so that you can log into the back end and start filling in the content, um, it, which is, again, very easy to do. I'll create several tutorial videos showing you how to do that. So um, again, I look forward to your feedback, Jacqueline, on the direction that I'm going in, uh, the work that I've done so far. Let me know what you think about the layout and color scheme. Um, thank you very much, and I look forward to getting your feedback. Goodbye.